Ladies and gentlemen, we are here with, once again, another Call of Duty. Another Call of Duty freaking video. Okay, this one, we, we talking. We just chilling, we just talking, okay? Let me tell you something. I am not a get, about to get rammed in the butt by Call of Duty, okay? For another BS release of a game. No freaking way, all right? No way. So I was watching some videos on YouTube, mostly by the Ghost of Ada. In a live stream, I think it was a nine hour live stream. I got, I was playing on controller, doing trash. And I was like, I'm not this bad at Call of Duty. Like I'm, I'm not great, but once I get into the rhythm of things, I should be doing really good. I should be doing, like I've been playing Call of Duty since Call of Duty 4, okay, Mono Warfare. We're talking like 360. I've been playing it on Xbox. I feel like I've been playing it on controller. <laughs> when I go into a game and I'm like, why am I trash at this freaking game with a controller that's giving me aim assist? There's reasons, okay? There's reasons. And you're not gonna like these reasons, all right? Uh, we don't have to worry about this video because I already knew that everything from Modern Warfare 2 was going into Modern Warfare 3. Modern Warfare 3 should have been a free update for everybody. It should have been a free update. Um, Sledgehammer should have made their own game, done their own thing. If they mess it up again, that is their own fault, their own problem. Okay? Someone needs to wake them the hell up. The well, SBMM pads, and we don't need to watch the video. But i tell you something. I used a shotgun in one of my clips. If I get it, I'll post it. Like, I'll put it in the video somewhere. I literally got two shots with a shotgun. And he just, the guy just didn't die. All right, I'm, using, I'm not using a controller, actually. I was using mouse and keyboard. I freaking shot the guy. You can watch the kill cam. He's bleeding. Like, he is bleeding. The, the screen is red. And I shoot him again before he's able to shoot me. And for some reason, he just didn't die. Okay? He does it to me, and he takes his two shots. On the second shot, I'm dead. I'm like, what is this? Okay, I don't want this crap in my game. I'm pretty sure there was a Call of Duty... That had hit register before and it freaking sucked but it was like small it was minor it sucked then and it sucks now okay so if there is such a thing as hit reg this there was a picture here somewhere hold up prove player match making in multiplayer and gaming environments okay images game security game management access aspects data identities accounts player histories like for building a team for providing a buddy list like Cooperative team behavior, team match players based on subjective variables such as likability and a general fun factor to tailor gaming content based on the social group itself. So, I mean, I don't understand. I don't understand why we have to have these kind of things in video games. Let me tell you something. Okay. I'm pretty sure 2019 is when all this crap started and it's getting worse. It's just getting worse. So you're telling me that you've been playing the game since 2019. It is now 2023, going on the year 2024. And you need this stuff to protect you. Because you can't get good at a fucking game. It is not that hard. It's just, you don't have to put in a lot of efforts. I'm sitting here working like 30 hours, 40 hours a week, and I'm still doing better than most of y'all. And I have no time at all. So I mean, if, if this is in the game, and I'm pretty sure it is, one, Good luck trying to use controller when you're facing uh, people with mouse and keyboard. Because I used the mouse and keyboard yesterday for my stream, and I pff, it was easy, like no problem until I, until the SBMM kicked in. I'm like, okay, what the hell happened? Then you got Ninja. Let's watch a Ninja video. Oh, let's watch a Ninja video. Let's just skip to the part where Ninja actually starts talking, because I don't want to. Because he's he's funny by himself. If you're not subscribed to this guy, you should go subscribe. He's funny. He's a funny dude. Need me. Need to save you from your trash Call of Duty streams, dude. Go. Okay, wait, wait, wait. I'm actually so excited mm -hmm. to play the next COD. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're doing it. Yeah. Hey, hey, they're doing everything right, bro. Yep. They're doing everything right this time, yep. dude. You just kind of stop listening to, like... Dude, they're doing everything right, bro. They're listening to the community this time, dude. <laughs> dude, I'm telling you, bro. Uh, brand new COD. This is the one, bro. They know what they're doing, man. They've learned from their mistakes. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go out on a limb and say that the new COD is going to be riddled with glitches and cheaters when it's when it launches probably. oh and it'll take on, the most hold up there's a clip too yes 
Here's a clip. Watch this. Here's a clip. Look at this guy. Watch this guy. Dead. He's going. He's going. It's crazy, man. It's crazy how there's people cheating in the beta. Like clearly, they they clearly didn't learn nothing from Modern Warfare 2. They're just trying to get you in on a cash grab. They do minor adjustments, and you guys are hyped over nothing. Like they they do small adjustments, and it's like holy crap, holy crap! Did you see the new Call of Duty? Oh my God! You got slide canceling. Congratulations! How about we fix more than just one thing? Like how about we just actually do the job that we're supposed to be doing? Like why do we need SBMM? Why do we need all, need all this extra stuff? Why are we trying to protect the people that are trash at the game? Like, they're trash at the game for a reason. They don't try. They don't try to be good at the game. So let them, let them be trash. If they don't want to try, let them be trash. They deserve to get trashed on if they don't even want to try. They don't even want to make an effort to even trying, okay? Like, you don't have to watch YouTube videos. You don't have to. You just play a Call of Duty, and eventually you play it enough, you'll get good on, on your own. Like, you, you just naturally get good at what you're supposed to do and what you're not supposed to do. Where you throw a nade, where you don't throw a nade. You know what I mean? Like, where you aim, where you don't aim. When you jump, you don't jump. When you slide, you don't slide. When you slide, cancel, and then jump, 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 jump. You'll get, you'll get good at that. You won't get as good as people on the computer, though. I mean, that shit's fucking fast. You just boom, 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 boom. Like, you switch the computer, man. Oh, my God. That's just, that's just crazy. Anyway. <laughs> boom, 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 boom. Right? So I don't understand. Like, I'm not going to. I am cautious because I'm not going to get swindled again. So I'm going to wait a month. Maybe two months. I'm going to probably wait two months for the for Call of Duty to be released. Two months after the release, whenever they get a discount, I might buy it. But if this stuff is still in the game, I'm not even going to bother. And it's worse than what Modern Warfare 2 was when it comes to the skill-based matchmaking. Because they got hit reg. They got aim assist. Like, your aim assist just turns off. All of a sudden, pff, you can't use aim assist anymore. And it's like, sure, you could, you, could, you could say that aim assist is basically cheating. But listen, if controllers couldn't use aim assist... They wouldn't be able to play the game so you can say what you want but using a thumb like the only thing the controller is good for is doing like cinematics you want to do some cinematic stuff in slow-mo controller is very good at that okay but for actual like when it comes to shooting moving stuff nah <laughs> like hey, good luck you need they need aim assist but it can't it can't be too high and it can't be like too low or even shut off okay that's just bs Anyway, so I was just making sure that this was 100%. You go on to Twitter, you just type in SBMM, and there's a whole, there's a whole freaking thing. Watch this. To the people who say, oh, you can't just spend your time shitting on noobs, they need to learn the game too. Mm -hmm. Motherfucker, since MW2019, you are telling me you gooch lickers still suck at the They'll game? suck. That you need SBMM this yep. thick? Since Bro. 2019, none of you guys have actually learned how to play the fucking game? Bro. Are you dead ass? Bro. Four fucking years Four you years. still suck? Mm -hmm. Holy shit. Mm -hmm. You pissers are literally the reason why SBMM continues to exist in the way that it does. Bro. Before you say skill issue, I can guarantee it's not a skill you 95% of the people who say skill issue liked MW2019. Bro. Liked MW2019 Part 2. Bro. If you like either of those games, I am sorry to tell you, but you fucking suck you dick suck at, at the cop. game. To the people yep. who say, oh, you yep. can't just spend your time That's shitting a hard on noobs. They need a to hard true. A hard true. You've been playing the same, the same style with minor adjustments since 2019. And if you still suck at the game, you should probably stop playing Call of Duty. Go play something else. Call of Duty is clearly not your thing. You don't need protection. You need to get better. That's it. Okay, this is not a PvE game. We just go around shooting AI the entire time. It's PvP. People are... Like, some people take it too far with the freaking esports stuff, okay? They're trying to play a freaking, like, public lobby. And they're trying to take it into esports level. It's like, just calm down, bro. Okay, you're not... You're, you, listen, you're, you're gonna live after the freaking game. Calm down, okay? You're, you'll be alive, okay? <laughs> You, you will live. You don't need a slide cancel bunny hop every freaking 10 seconds. You calm down, okay? Chillax. <laughs> All right? Good job watching your, like, 40, 50, 60 freaking hours of YouTube stuff to try and get everything all right. Calm down, <laughs> okay? Chillax. <laughs> well, look at these guys. 
They're straight up trash. He's pan he's he's so bad that he's he's panicking. He doesn't know what to do. He's panicking. He's literally an AI. There you go. He is literally an AI. Look at that. How are they supposed to get better if they don't face people that are actually relatively good? You know what I mean? Look at that. Why is he throwing a grenade there? There are Semtex. Didn't. Flash. He missed the flash. Look at that. <laughs> it's just sad. It's just sad. now if that's gen if that's genuinely a good a, a normal like if that's genuinely a actual person that's new at the game, okay. But ah, uh, you know what I mean? Like ah, uh, how are you that bad at Call of Duty? Uh, th uh, true. The respawns in Modern Warfare Three trash. They they suck. That's what ranks for. That's true. Like if you want, if you want skill-based matchmaking, go play rank mode. Good luck. Good luck trying to get out of bronze. <laughs> okay. Good luck trying to get out of bronze. Okay. Anyway, you get my drift. Like I, I am hesitant as hell when it comes to Modern Warfare 3, because what did they do with it? You can slide cancel. The movement is better. Fantastic. What about the rest of the game? The cannon sights, people are trying to turn off the cannon sights already in the game. They don't want it. It sucks. It's trash. Why did the cannon, the cannon sights has been in Modern Warfare, has been in Call of Duty since Modern Warfare 3. All right, I have to correct myself here after editing. Um, I went to Modern Warfare 3 and actually looked to see if I had the cannon sights in Modern Warfare 3. And they do, but it's like a hybrid sight. So the cannon sight. From what I'm aware of, actually didn't come into Call of Duty until Modern Warfare 2019 is when it came into Call of Duty. So it's been in the game since 2019. It's existed since 2019 that I know of so far. Um, the game that I got it confused with was Battlefield 4. Battlefield 4 allows you to use a cannon sight. So it's not like this is a revolutionary thing, regardless. Cannon sights, to an extent, still, li still existed in Call of Duty, but you didn't aim the gun sideways you can aim the gun up and then go back down so you use the red dot up and then you just go back down there's pictures on the screen you see what i'm saying what i'm saying but it basically functions the same thing but instead of you don't have you don't turn your gun sideways but it functions the same way that was a mistake but a lot of battlefield 4 when it came out oh my god i love that game so drink freaking much but it didn't exist that i'm aware of until 2019 modern warfare the candid site the actual candid site thing now if someone knows if it existed before that, please tell me. But I looked in Modern Warfare 3, I looked in Black Ops 2, and I didn't find it. So I could have swore it existed at some point before 2019, but I guess maybe I'm wrong. So either way, it was still some sort of thing that existed in some way in the game. It's not a revolutionary thing. All right, let's get back to the video. When they actually introduced Canon Sights, the only thing that this site might be good for is sliding but they have a perk in the game that allows you to just aim down your sights while sliding why don't you just have it so that you can just aim down the sights by default when sliding I, I mean i don't i don't know who makes these call of duty games anymore but they're clearly stupid they're clearly they clearly have no freaking idea what they're doing they obviously don't play the freaking game i can tell you that and if they do they're probably in the low freaking bracket of sbmm a hundred percent a hundred percent Okay, 100 percent. Hey, I can sit here and spew behind the camera all I want, but if people are gonna keep buying the game, if people are gonna keep buying the skins, supporting what they do, I can't say nothing. It has to get so bad to the point where even the freaking low-level SBMM noobs say, "Hey, this is freaking stupid." So when that day comes, that'll be a good day. I can tell you that. If you want to pre-purchase the game, if you want to buy the game, that's entirely up to you, man. I hope you enjoy the game. Okay, I hope you enjoy the game. I personally hope that I'm wrong with my. Not really assumptions because I showed you like I showed you proof that they are actually going into further in depth with the SPMM, and they also got some AI BS. So good luck with that, <laughs> you know. So this video's gone for twenty minutes. Anyway, I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care and bye bye.